Hey guys and welcome back. Um, super quick tutorial today. Do you want to make your charts super dynamic? That is, the titles change based on the selections that you made. So essentially, when no selections have been made, the chart shows sales for all countries. But when I make some selections on some countries, it automatically shows sales for the selections that I've made. So how do we do that? Well, let's look into it. First things first, um, there are two different functions that you need to learn. First one is get selected count. So what does get selected count do? Well, automatically it just brings the number of selections you have made in a field that you call. For example, here I say get selected count and my field is country. And when I make selections in country, now I've selected three, it shows three. Now let's change this get selected count to get field selections. What does this do? Well, this essentially what it does is it brings the selections that this field makes. If I select a country now, it brings in the value of the selections that I've made. Cool. Now that we know these two functions, we can actually make our um, title dynamic. Let's look at how to do that. Let's select the chart, go into appearance, go into general, go into title. And we're going to write a simple if statement here. And what is it? Well, we say that if by chance, now we want to know if the user has made a selection. How do we do that? Well, by seeing get selected count. So if get selected count for the country is equal to zero, that means that the user has not made any selections. Then I want the title to be, and we, I put it in, well, it's a string, right? So you put it in single quotes and I write in the title for when the user makes no selections. That is sales for all countries. Great. But in case the user makes a selection, then in that case, get selected count will be greater than zero. Then we can fill in our else, else statement. And what is the else statement? It starts with the string again, that is sales for. Then I wanted to bring the country names. So how do I do that? Um, well, you can just close this and um, you can concatenate. That is, you say, and how do we bring in the country names? Well, the other function that we talked about called get field selections and again my field in this case is country so if the user makes no selections in the field country then in that case i want the title to be sales for all countries but otherwise i want the title to be sales for and bring in the selections that the user has made super simple right um, i need to close this done click on apply and now we see that when we make selections it changes here we've got a bunch of tips and tricks um, that help you really elevate your dashboard so check out the masterclass uh, link below and uh, please like see you in the next one peace